it. When it comes to facial hair, Spokane police are limited to just mustaches and short goatees, but this November, patrol officers had a chance to ditch their razors for a worthy cause. I think uh, one of our officers, Officer David Corinne, came up with the idea. He presented it to Chief Meidel to do this and to support a charity, which that charity that uh, he selected was Community Cancer Fund. About 40 cops donated a minimum 50 bucks to putting the fuzz back into police work and the beard started getting longer. One of our detectives, our female detectives, she wanted to be part of this as well. So um, she made the challenge, the, grow, uh, the beard growing challenge a little bit interesting by deciding to donate 250 to whoever won the contest. The public went online and voted Major King's beard the best of the bunch, and so King promptly donated his winnings to the Community Cancer Fund as well. So, Jared, on behalf of the Spokane Police Department, in, in honor of No Shave November, I would like to present to you this check from the Spokane Police Department for $3,550, and I want to thank you for everything you do for our cancer patients in the city of Spokane. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks, you guys. Police pick Spokane's Community Cancer Fund because when you're battling a disease, the last thing you need to worry about is money. Gas cards, help with medications, uh, lodging initiatives. Jared Kiefer appreciates the donation and what our officers do for us every day. The fact that the Spokane Police Department does so much for our community, and but then would take the, the next step and really help us out when they have so much going on, but to help not only the Community Cancer Fund, but the, the local community is just, it's really, really cool.